Now, a three news exclusive. Our Mark Namick has learned former Cleveland City Councilman Bashir Jones is part of an FBI investigation. Here's Mark's report. Former Cleveland Councilman Bashir Jones, who ran unsuccessfully for mayor last year, is under FBI scrutiny. Three News has learned. A subpoena issued by a federal grand jury was sent weeks ago to City Hall seeking records on a number of organizations and individuals with ties to Jones, according to sources familiar with the contents of the subpoena. Three News asked for a copy on Tuesday. The city has acknowledged it has one and is still reviewing our request before making the document public. Among the entities named in the subpoena, sources tell 3 News, is Northeast Ohio Neighborhood Health Services, a financially struggling nonprofit on the city's east side that Jones championed while on city council. Council voted last year to give $2 million from the Federal American Rescue Plan Act to the group. The city has yet to release any of that money to the health organization, which has several major debts. The subpoena seeks any records on a woman named Mecca East, a health advocate. In the past, Jones described East in media interviews as his wife and the mother of his children. During his campaign, he paid her for administrative services, records show. The subpoena also wants any records on King Management, a property consultant, and the Famicos Foundation, a nonprofit that works to redevelop the city's east side. Numerous attempts were made tonight to reach Jones for comment, but were unsuccessful. Now, Jones has not been accused of any wrongdoing, but as the subpoena suggests, his activities are drawing the attention of federal prosecutors. Jones remains politically active. He backed former council president Kevin Kelly in the mayor's general election, and he just recently endorsed Republican Lee Weingart in this year's race for Cuyahoga County Executive. And Russ, we expect to get those subpoenas tomorrow. Okay, Mark Namick in the newsroom. Thank you.